Hello, welcome back to my channel and to another reaction video. This time we'll be checking the honest trailer for Beauty and the Beast 1991. It's a tale as old as time, a song as old as rhyme, an enchantress turning an 11 year old into a feral monster who 10 years later traps a girl in a castle until she loves him. You know, that old chestnut, <laughs> Beauty and the Beast. Welcome to this poor provincial French village where everyone has an American accent. It's not right for a woman to read. What's wrong with her? She's crazy. Marie, the baguette. And meet Belle, daughter of the local killing machine inventor. Belle, look out! Belle longs for adventure, and she'll get just that when she's kidnapped by the Beast, a prince who's so bad at his job, he's been missing for 10 years, and no one seems to notice. <laughs> what is this place? Watch romance bloom between her and Prince him they never do say his name do they in this fairy tale that teaches every kid it's what's on the inside that counts but it doesn't hurt to be so rich you own a castle with its own library and some magic slaves cheer as this strong smart independent woman rejects this violent controlling bad-mannered hairy dude who imprisons her dad for this violent controlling bad-mannered Harry, dude, who imprisons her dad? <laughs> Wait, why does he lock up her dad? The dude clearly wants to be left alone. I'll give him yep. a place to stay. Couldn't he just, you know, let him leave and get eaten by wolves or something? That yep. seems a lot easier than feeding an old man for decades. But Belle isn't alone. She's trapped with dozens of living objects that raise dozens of uncomfortable questions like... Did everything that moves used to be a person? Like, are all those plates people? And what happened to all the actual stuff? Did it merge with the servants? Will they go to trial for murdering all those villagers? That bureau straight up crushes that guy. If the beast earned the curse, why did all his servants get deformed too? Man, this movie is messed up. So be Disney's guest at this tale as old as Stockholm Syndrome, which was the first <laughs> animated feature to be nominated for Best Picture, but lost to a movie with a very similar plot. You will die. Join me for dinner. It rubs the lotion on its skin or else it gets the hose again. And managed to distract us from its messed up story with some of Disney's most beloved songs. Like the I'm Too Good For This Play song. There goes the baker, oh my god, I hate him. <laughs> Doesn't he know I'm gluten free? Everyone here is so lame. Oh my god, I can't even believe this stupid town. Hey, crap. Good morning, peasant. Where are you off to? The bookshop. I just finished the most wonderful story, but you probably don't know how to read. Sweet Christ. You read? No one cares. Shut up. The treat is like with jerks. The sucking yourself up song. I guess he's rich. And sometimes kind, but he looks like a woolly mammoth shaved behind. I do love dogs, but I'm not sure that a dog man is someone I think I could fork. The It Sucks to Work Here song. Go ahead, stuff your face. We are both stuck in this place. We got here with no idea. We turn into an Ikea. There's no bricks, there's no pay. And we're trapped in here all day. Just because my boss was a dick, I become a French candlestick. None of us is your deed. Our poor friends eat twilight. That guy used to be a restaurant made to be. Now for the ten years pass, he only sees me. I must confess, we are oppressed. Get snapped in half if we protest. We're so stressed and depressed, let us rest. And the toxic relationship song. Cut her off from friends. <laughs> oh, shit. And her family. Throw her in a cage. Fly into a rage. Unpredictably. She can't get away. She can't be released. She's in constant fear. Cause she's trapped in there. Please call the police. Starring the CrossFit Bro, a pity la fool, furry <laughs> guy in a little coat, must love dogs. This French guy's on fire. It's always 435 somewhere. Tea she poured. 
and this young boy in an old man's mouth. Ugh. Holy Mama. shit. Ugh. Saved by the bell. Damn. Do I still have to sleep in the cupboard? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You have 20 brothers and sisters, so yeah, you probably do. <laughs> hey, well, there you have it, folks. <laughs> yeah, that was. That's, I forgot that even happened. Creepy, but hey, honestly, this was one of my favorites uh, growing up, and the and the very opening opening theme with the movie start is one of the best ever. But yeah, there was a whole lot of messed up stuff in this movie, and yeah, this is the <laughs> prime example uh, example of Stockholm syndrome. And yeah, it's not. Uh, it's no secret that the uh, uh, older stuff are quite pro problematic in today's standards, but what can you do? Anyway, what do you guys think? Write your thoughts down below. Hope you enjoyed my next one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, if you want, and I will see you in another video.